Aloha, 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 beautiful soul. Welcome at Friday Inspirations. And now that I'm recording this, I realize I did not put on my purple clothes. I'm so sorry. But nevertheless, we are going to purity. I've prepared for you a beautiful meditation to take you towards purity, towards your essence, towards who you truly are. So buckle up <laughs> and let's get into it. Let's dive into that beautiful being that you are. So if you want, you can close your eyes and I continue repeating this. For those who have not followed this, this kind of meditations before, with your breath is perfect as it is. There's no reason in Ho'oponopono to take on a different kind of breath. There's no reason to tweak your breath for a deeper breath or for a more shallow breath or longer exhale or longer inhale. Your breath can be as you are at this moment because it is the perfect expression of you always always so go ahead breathe in your in your divine breathe breath and feel how air is coming in and how air is being released through your outbreath. And in general, when you are just putting all your focus on your breath, by itself, it will change without you doing it. Because your breath will always seek to be the most perfect expression of who you are at each moment. Breathe in the pureness of, of air, the pureness of energy, the pureness of breath. And breathe out the pureness of you, the pureness of things that are ready to be released. The pureness of things that are ready to shift so that you can shift. And now allow this breath to go down to your to where you feel most pure inside of yourself. So in my case, it would be my heart, but that may be a different location for you. So breathe in all that air to the place where you feel most pure inside of yourself. And the air is pure and that place is pure. And therefore, what you exhale is also pure. It's the purest form of you. Breathe in pureness. Go to pureness. Breathe out pureness. You have difficulty finding the pure spots, then just go settle with your breath somewhere and purify that area. As you are inhaling purity, that spot will be touched by the purity. And with that, will become purity. And allow 
and allow yourself to be in that pure you, in that inner purity. And what are the images coming up? What is happening when you are there? There's no need to change it. If you feel like making it bigger, then go ahead, but there's no need. Because it is taking up all the room that it needs. The pure spot inside of you is as big as it can be at this moment. And it will enlarge itself when it's ready to enlarge. There's no need for you to do that with your mind. You can release the talk of your mind about how it should be, how it should look like, how you should feel. And allow yourself this moment of being one with that purity inside of you. Being one with that pure being that you are. There's no need to spread that purity throughout your body because your whole body is already reacting to you breathing purity to that pure spot. There's no need to have your mind do all kinds of things. You can allow yourself to be. And when you are ready, and this may still take some time before you are ready, but when you are ready, you can focus yourself again on your breath, and wiggle your toes or your fingers to get back into awareness without releasing your, your connection to that purity. Allow yourself to journey to go into purity, but also out of that pure state while still staying in them in it. And when you're ready, you can open your eyes. Wishing you so much joy on the journey of life, on the journey of this day, the journey of this hour, on the journey of being you. Bye-bye, sweet soul.